everybody, welcome back. Today's video is a little different. Uh, I'm just going to make a little bit of a modification to my bench that uh, you saw, you know, a few videos back. Uh, I need to put a break on the edge so I can do some forming for sheet metal stuff. There's all sorts of little sheet metal pieces that have to be made for the bike yet. And I need the break, uh, just a small one. I've got a bigger one over on the dark side. Uh, it's minus 25 in the dark side right now. So I'm not doing any work over there at the moment. Um, pretty soon that side will be heated, but it's been a summer project, months of work over there. So anyhow, I'm, uh, I'm back on it. Uh, hang around if you want to see me work on the bench a little bit. Other than that, not much work on the bike today. Uh, quick little video. Stick around. So here's the two pieces that I've been working on in the shop uh, on the dark side over there a little bit. A uh, couple of, uh, drilled a couple of holes, elongated them just so I can get some travel. So when I weld this onto the end of my uh, bar, I can now get this to travel for some setback. So when I bend, I can get a different radius on the bends. Uh, don't need much. Most of this stuff's fairly light, so I don't need much setback. So that's plenty, more than I need to uh, make it work. I'll uh, show you a couple more pictures here in a bit when I get this set up for my hold down and uh, we'll get on with it. It's looking pretty good. I now have my um, breaker bar set up. I've got a couple of little pieces of trim that I've been using on the outside of the building to set my zero setback so this can't come forward anymore. Now I'll tack my two ends on uh, to keep my angles on here. We'll put our springs under here once we take all this junk out of here and build up ourselves up a handle that screws into the table. And that's how we'll tighten down our breaker bar to push down on the uh, sheet and then we'll be able to fold it up. So here we go, uh, the finished up, it needs a paint job, but uh, finished up bench top break. Uh, we can set our setback very easily uh, where we want it to go, tighten down the two sides to hold the metal down in place, give it a bend turn it around, give it another bend, whatever we need to do, and uh, we're ready to go. So a uh, little tool uh, worked pretty good. I can take this, unscrew the, uh, the two hold downs, take this piece right off the, the bench, and then it's flat from here right across the top of the bench, just two little hinge pieces hanging on the bench and uh, give me more space to uh, work on other stuff. So um, that's how she's going to work. Like I say, I'll paint it up and uh, you'll see it in future videos. Uh, I'll definitely get some use out of this.